Hello students, in your last class we have studied about the 7th chapter that is PowerPoint. What is a PowerPoint? In which more than two slides run together, they create a presentation or a PowerPoint. Now, it is very effective when we create a presentation to describe some uh, topics, but we can make our presentation more interesting, more eye catching. How? by adding objects to our presentation. Now, that is your 8th chapter that is objects in PowerPoint 2016 in which we will study how we can insert objects, different type of objects like you have studied in word, uh, pictures, shapes that all things are objects. Here also in your presentation we can add the different type of objects like we can insert shapes, we can insert pictures, we can insert smart arts, graphics and uh, we can also create a photo album with the help of the presentation. These objects make your slide very informative and very eye catching. So, here we will start our first topic that is how we can insert picture in the presentation. Now, first topic is how to insert picture. To insert a picture in a slide, first of all you have to select a slide. Uh, this is a slide, but we will change its layout. Go here and we will select a blank layout first of all. Then we will select, this is the slide where you want to insert a picture. Go here in the insert option uh, tab. Then can you see your pictures? Click on the pictures you will get different uh, uh, picture uh, folders, wherever your picture is there you can go there, I am going here, I am selecting this picture and after that click on insert. Okay, This is your picture, you can resize it very easily, the boundaries you can see, the dotted lines, this is your dotted lines and this is your slides, you can change it, here you can see the changes, this is your slide. If you want to resize it, you can just resize it by clicking at the corner of it, see, okay. Uh, and when you just uh, go here, whenever you insert any picture in your slide, here one more picture tools tab will open up, this is your format, here you can crop it like uh, I will crop it, see, ok. You can crop the picture also, this is we are formatting the picture, now see, ok. Uh, here you can crop the picture, you can style your, uh, change your picture style, you can add your artistic effects, you can do many things as you have done in the uh, last class in your word. Uh, after that we can insert the shape also, we will take a new slide, can you see this is the new slide, ok. Here we are going to insert the shape, to insert a shape again you have to go to the insert option. See here, uh, there is no extra tab, ok, but whenever we insert anything, an extra tab will open up here. So, we, here we are going to insert the um, shapes, go for insert, then go for the picture, take any of the picture, here cloud is ins inserted in your test book, so I will also insert a cloud, select the cloud and your pointer will change to a plus sign, means you have selected a shape. Click your plus sign and just drag it, this is your shape. The shape appears in the slide with the boundary around it, use the handles around the boundary to resize it or rotate the shape, here also you can rotate the shape, see, you can resize it. If you want to type in the text, you, if you want, you can do that also. You can add that, add, add the uh, anything like I will change its size. How can you see? Yeah. 
visible. Okay. Now, when you insert a shape in the slide, here you can see the drawing tools form a tab appears on which uh, in the and the, this ribbon also can change C. Okay, its ribbon is changed. In this uh, uh, format tab, you can change the shape color, shape style, word art style. Okay, I have selected this. Okay, you can insert the shape, you can sh uh, change the shape outline, you can apply the shape effects and styles. Next is how we can insert a text box. So, we will take a new slide again. This is your new slide. Here there is no text box where we can write anything. So, we want to have one text box where we can write down. Like for example, So, I, I want something to write here. But here there is no text box. So, um, what is a text box? A text box is a holder text place holder where you can write down the text like for example uh, uh, here is I will change the layout okay see here this is the title we can write only here we cannot write here so suppose you want to write here what you will do you can insert a text box go to the insert go to the text box can you see your text box just click it and your mouse pointer will change not a plus sign but a different sign. This is not a plus sign. Okay, just click and drag. Now this is your text placeholder. You can write down here anything. Inserting text box. Okay, this is okay. If you want another, you can insert it anywhere you want. Suppose here, write down anything. Again, I will write down text box. Okay, this is what is a text box. You can insert it any, anywhere in your own slide. And uh, the next is inserting a smart art graphic. What is a smart art? First of all, smart art graphics are the diagrams that you use visually to communicate information in a very interesting and easily understandable manner. They are grouped under various categories like list, process, cycle, hierarchy, relationship, matrix, pyramid, picture and office.com. Every smarter graphic is made up of one or more shapes. Like for example, in your um, classes, you cycles cycle, water cycle, life cycle. Aapko cycle bana ke jata. Why? Because you understand it more clearly when it is made like a cycle. So here also if you want to uh, show any type of different type of graphics, you can use the smart art. So to insert a smart art, go to insert. Here you can see the smart art. Okay. Aap sabne life cycle padhi hai, hum life cycle hi banayenge. Okay. We will select this. You can select any. Okay. This is the list of it. If you want any type different, you can use that. We will use the cycle itself. Click on OK. Can you see? Suppose ye nahi hai. Okay, how you can write inside it? Just click on it. Okay. And start writing. Like, uh, I will complete this. See, I have completed your cycle. Is it visible to you all? Okay, this is your um, life cycle what you study. Okay, this is your smart art. Here we have made a life cycle. Now, for today, this much only. Today we have studied how to insert a picture, how to insert a shape and how to insert a smart art and how to insert a text box. For inserting anything, we have to go to the insert tab. In insert tab, you will get how to insert a picture. Here you can insert a shape. Here you can insert a smart art. And with the help of this, you can insert a text box. Now, whenever you insert any object, one more extra tool will be added. For picture, there will be picture tools. For shape, there will be drawing tools. 
for textbooks also there will be drawing tools and for smart art there will be smart art double tap that is one is design and another one is format how to modify the smart art we will study in the next chapter and how to create a photo album also we will study the next chapter for um, one thing I should tell you that if you want to modify a smart art you, you will use these two extra tab for formatting and editing it.